and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an everyday makeup tutorial. Obviously, I don't do this every single day. Most days, I just wake up, throw on a sweatshirt, have school, but some days I'm kind of feeling like doing my makeup, I will do this. I don't usually do this much eyeshadow. If you keep watching, you'll see how this happened. If you have never seen my face before and you want to subscribe, make sure to subscribe to my channel. I'll put a little button right there. If you want to see how I got this look, then keep watching. First thing I'm doing is taking my Hangover Primer by Too Faced. Love this stuff, would recommend. I usually honestly put the pumps like on my finger or like on my face, but I've been putting it on my finger so I don't use too much on accident because that would be bad. And I'm pretty much just taking it, putting it all over my face. Honestly, using my camera as a mirror right now. And throughout the video, I will switch to a different mirror. I'm actually gonna do that now. This is my mirror, just by the way, if I'm looking that way. Then I just take it and rub it in with my hands. Now that my primer is all rubbed in, it's a moisturizing primer, but it doesn't always moisturize my face as much as I need to to have it all good. So usually I put like a tiny bit of this. So I just take it and put like the tiniest, tiniest little bit on like in between my eyebrows. Then I take the tiny little bit and put it on my chin. Okay, so it's been about five minutes. I just wanted to wait to let my moisturizer just kind of settle in so it doesn't look packy because I read online that that can happen. I do not usually put my hair up if I'm being honest and I just want to make this kind of an honest video so I'm not going to put my hair up. 100% would recommend using a hair tie. I am using the Milk Makeup Sunshine Skin Tint in the color medium and I love this stuff. It has SPF 30 and it is the best thing and I'm going to be applying it with this brush. This is from Amazon. I'll try and link all the products that I'm mentioning down below. So I'm going to zoom you guys in just so you can see my face a little better. What you do is you just take it and you pump it up. Pump it up. Now I'm just rolling it on. I swear if I get it in my hair. That was so much. I feel like that's gonna be a lot, but let's look at the edge. Now I'm just gonna blend it, cue the music, and the speeding up. To do it on my eyebrows, like right there, I'm going to be using this smaller brush. I am taking my Instant Age Rewind Concealer by Maybelline and I'm going to put a little of it on this angled brush. I'm just going to put it right there. This is just to try and conceal some of the redness. So after that is as covered up as it's gonna get. Now onto under eyes. I'm starting with this Boing Concealer by Benefit. Don't be like, oh my god, she's using her fingers. What a gross thing. I'm sorry. This honestly works better if I use my fingers. It's just like a base coat pretty much. I literally just put it like there before I put on my other concealer just because the other one's a little light. This is really dark. It's darker than my foundation. You'll see that when I put it on. <laughs> this is gonna be gross. Literally if you're afraid of it, don't watch this. And I pretty much just rub this like there. Okay, after I do that, I'm taking my Instant Age Rewind Concealer. I do three layers of concealer. I'm not a beauty guru. This is just what works for me. So I just take this, I kind of hold my eye down like that, do a circle, and then I drag it down a little. Then I'm taking my Beauty Blender. This is a real one, by the way. I went out and bought a real one, so go me. And I just blend this in. It's blended, like I swear it's all blended. I know it looks like there's a line. There's like one line right there that will not be covered by anything it refuses to be taking my beauty blender and then after i'm done with my eye concealer i'm going to take it i already did it but i'm going to take it and put a line there one there and then i'm just going to put a little bit around my mouth then i'm going to take my beauty blender and blend that in then I'm taking my e.l.f. translucent powder. So I'm just going to take this on this powder brush. This is from um, Eco Tools, And I'm just putting this all over my face. Now 
now on to bronzer i'm taking my hula bronzer looks like this and i'm taking this brush this is an elf angled blush brush i do not contour my cheekbones because it's already like so like reddish like there it just looks like i have dirt smeared across my face just contour my jawline so i'm just gonna do that Now on to eyes. So I am taking the Instant Age Rewind Concealer by Maybelline. Put this on my eyelids just to prime them. And then I'm done, that's just it. So yeah, I hope you enjoy, bye. Then I'm taking these Little Beauty Blenders and I'm just going to blend that in. Now I'm taking out the Morphe 350 palette. Um, literally already got fingerprints on it, just got it yesterday. So I guess this isn't really part of my everyday makeup routine because I haven't do done this every day, obviously, if I just got this. This is what it looks like. I haven't used any of the colors yet. It's literally perfect. Oh my gosh. I love it so much. So I'm taking this brush. And I'm just going to put this all over my whole lid. It's I'm taking the color I just showed and I'm just kind of brushing this up into the oh my god usually I'm not used to that much coming off well uh if you couldn't tell this is my first time using a real makeup palette that has actual pigmentation so I wasn't expecting that to happen I'm just gonna work with it okay I swear it looks worse on camera it doesn't look that bad but now I'm taking this Eagle Tools brush <laughs> So I just basically took that and just drew a line from there to there. Now I'm taking this shimmery shade and I'm just putting this in the middle here. This doesn't look that bad. Like I know it looks really bad, but I swear it's not that bad. Now I'm taking my beauty blender. Uh, this isn't a beauty blender. My eyelash curler. Not sure where this is from. Had it for literally 1800 years. Then I'm taking my mascara from Too Faced and applying this to my eyelash. Then I'm taking my Eco Tools Smoother Outer Thingy and smoothing out. Then I just do my bottom lashes super carefully because I always mess up. So. The last thing that I'm doing is I'm taking my Becca Champagne Pop Highlighter and I'm just putting that where it needs to be. I'm just gonna take it and put it, you know, in the spot where it's supposed to be. I take this, kind of bring it up into there. Then I'm just going to take it, put a little bit on my nose and a little on my cupid bow. Thank you for watching my everyday makeup tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Just a quick disclaimer, I'm not a beauty guru. I don't know what I'm doing. I just kind of do things. Sometimes it ends up looking decent. So if you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.